I can't stress enough in videos that food-based side hustles really earn significant amounts of passive income. People search the major search engines and YouTube every day for everything food-related content. And yes, I'm up here at the Hibachi Buffet right now and I'm smashing it up real quick. Excuse me one second. Mmm, mmm, mmm. I'm diving in, man. Excuse me. Mm. Permit. You know why I'm actually eating food and making this video? Because I know videos like this will be quite profitable in the long run. And I don't have a care in the world about quote unquote what people think what, who does he think he is he's making a youtube video and eating food and he's talking about smashing it up real good yes i'm smashing it up real good elder king style i'm smashing it up I'm smashing it up food based content will build your side hustle from the ground floor up and if you stay focused in it for about two to four to five years posting content consistently to your blog and YouTube channel. Excuse me, one more moment. I'm, man, I'm, I'm so improper. Informal, improper, whatever you wanna call it, I don't care. Mm. Mm -hmm. Let me show you what I'm smashing up real quick. Mm. Got some peanut chicken, coconut shrimp. Today's Friday, it's smashing day. I got some General Tso's chicken. Excuse me, one moment. Mm. But um, back to what I was saying. See videos like this where you think it's like really improper or it's not formal or you know there's something wrong with a person eating food on video. It's videos like this that you could be making that will build your side hustle from the ground floor up. And if you have a passion for food, or eating at the restaurant, or giving restaurant reviews, food re I wish he would stop that. What a devil you gotta be doing that now. He ain't nothing but the day as I eat. <laughs> but if you have a, a niche for food, if you like cooking at home, if you like eating out at restaurants, if you like, um, whatever the case is, going to different buffets and making food-related video content and food-related blog posts and posting it to the internet. If you stay consistent with it for two to five years, you could be earning some really, really good money. And I just wanted to put that out there real quick before I go back to my food and I'd smash it up real quick. All right, folks, I gotta, I gotta finish smashing. I'm out, peace.